how empty airports are, but I guess I understand, but it's like we're in a pandemic or something. I'm serious, this airport is absolutely packed. Got through all of that. I'm not within six feet of anybody. It's pretty hard to do that in this airport right now, but I'm gonna be in New York for 24 hours only. I've never really had a trip where I've had to go somewhere for just 24 hours, let alone New York. Um, I'm going there to actually uh, film something for a company. They're flying me out to uh, film some videos, some business videos for that. that we're spoiled as like a society when I get annoyed when I have to type in my passcode on my iPhone instead of it scanning my face because of the mask. I know you guys are experiencing that too and I'm just like, I'm complaining because I have to type on my touch screen iPhone. Like, get over it, Bo. weird when we got off the plane uh, luckily I already did it online because I like did research on what I need to do in order to travel but they stopped everybody like police officers and you had to sign some like huge form or something saying that you're only gonna be here for 24 hours I don't know that's this is weird time to live in there he is the man the myth the legend mr. Nate Yeah, we got up and some dude was just screaming in like a Brooklyn accent, but somehow Spanish too. Welcome to New York, baby. We're in New York. We're in New York. Nate, you want to tell them how expensive this Uber is? This Uber ride is $84. $84 Ubers. <laughs> Welcome to New York, kids. Oh my Great. lord. Gotta try, work, pay those bills, man. If the corona hit the bills, would it be nice for me, you know? Yeah. But it hitting me and you. <laughs> they, they, they not hitting the bills, man. Yeah. yeah. We're in our room. We got the doubles. We're not sharing beds this time. <laughs> but now that we got that out of the way, now it's time for the real mission at hand tonight. Snacks! Yeah, much better. Jackpot. Yep. All right, see you guys in the morning. Nate, stand far away from me. <laughs> Stay on your footprint. How is it, man? Takes 30 from JFK, so we have to... I think we got to where we want to be. We earned ourselves a little beach time. Yep, we're gonna walk down the boardwalk here at Long Beach and we're gonna find a place to eat, hang out, maybe grab a beer or something. But I think we earned this. <laughs> it looks like New York's open for business. That's what I'm saying. I'm like, no one's wearing masks. Like, if you look at the beach. I mean, there's a lot of people. I don't know about this whole quarantine thing. I mean, I guess it's not quarantine, but pandemic. I gotta admit though, pretty beautiful day. Yeah. I mean, ugly day, horrible day, right? <laughs> Awful day to be at the beach. Awful. You know, I don't know if those people are social distancing right there, Nate. What do you think? No? It looks like the groups are distanced though. But... She called me. How do you feel after that, Nate? Great. Ain't nothing like the ocean, baby. Hey guys, a little uh, change of pace here because we're gonna take a journey up and find out that we've actually found a chair. That fits. Bo! What's up, mate? What's up, guys? <laughs> we, we found a chair that I fit in. Not a bad view, huh? Not a bad view. Usually lifeguard places, like on beaches, they always have uh, a lifeguard stand, but in New York, you just have a giant <laughs> pile of sand with a huge chair on it. And I'm all about it. As you can see, Nate is body surfing again, and uh, we're gonna go grab some food, but I'll probably see you guys back in Atlanta. I hope you've been loving this, these like travel vlogs and the vlogs being back. Um, should be pretty fun. Nate, I think I'm gonna wrap the vlog up until I get back to Atlanta. You wanna say bye to your new fans? Later, guys.
If you guys are in Long Beach, you need to come here. Like, this place is amazing. Yeah, Five Ocean. Don't be your shy self on camera. Yeah. Like, oh, my God. Me? Oh, my God. I'm not. I'm going to be The Bi-Girl drink. Come get the Bi-Girl drink. It's going to be there. There you go. <laughs> Good for you, man. Oh, that was awesome. I, 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 I'm tearing up a little bit. That was really romantic how you did that. Good for you, man. You know, you know man, honestly, some, I, so I heard this quote, and they're like, this woman said, she's like, it's not about like what you do in life, it's about how you do it. And I'm like, good for you. Like, I see what I'm like, that's love. Like, that's love right there, you know? Like, good for you, man. Cheers, dude. These girls just like ride by us on a bike, and what'd they say, Nate? <laughs> just maybe the people don't know that the middle is for bikes. <laughs> I don't think Bo would get hit by a bike. I think the bike would get hit by Bo. <laughs> <laughs>